Today we're going to show you um, a horse gastroscopy to diagnose stomach ulcers. Um, this is the image of a stomach uh, showing the whitish part, which is called the uh, squamous mucosa, and the more pink part, which is called the glandular mucosa, and the margin between both of them is called the margo plicatus. Most ulcers, they tend to occur around that location. Uh, this is uh, uh, to show you how we explore the uh, mucosa, close-up and personal. Um, this particular horse has still some food material and a little bit of uh, fluid in the stomach. And we are going to um, go take a dive to look for the exit of the stomach. The stomach exits uh, into the small intestine. Uh, the first part is called the duodenum. And uh, sometimes we see duodenal ulcers or pyloric ulcers, this particular location of the um, of the uh, small intestine is, is called the pylorus. Uh, we're going to see it coming right into view. Uh, there's that hole in there. We observe the pylorus from the stomach side to see whether there's any ulceration. In this case, that's completely clean. We also look for motility, make sure that it's able to contract as it is doing right now and open up again. We're going to drive our scope into the first part of the small intestine, also called the duodenum, and examine the mucosa, which is the internal lining. In this particular case, everything looks very good. There is no uh, ulcers. This fluid that is coming into view is the bile, which the liver secretes to help with the digestion. And it comes out through the duodenal papilla, which is that little knobbing that we can see on the screen right there. And uh, it is uh, important to examine this area, as, uh, as I said before, some ulcers tend to occur in this location. Um, here are some examples of a, uh, some uh, cases with stomach ulcers. This is a case of mild ulceration. We can see it on the squamous mucosa, on the white part of the stomach, those little nobbins, red nobbins or ulcerations, they are reasonably superficial. Here's a case with uh, a deeper um, ulceration. This is a moderate um, case uh, with um, ulcers right on the margo plicatus. And here is a horse with uh, a much deeper uh, ulcers. This particular horse had um, uh, performance issues uh, being uh, uh, difficult to handle sometimes and the horse not willing to uh, uh, cooperate. Um, this horse resolved fully with the use of um, Gastrogard, which is uh, the pharmaceutical compound of uh, omeprazole, um, which is very highly effective, opposite to the compounded omeprazole, which is um, um, basically uh, not not effective on treating uh, stomach ulcers and not as reliable as uh, Gastrogard. Thank you very much for visiting us. For more information, please visit our website at www.pmvetservices.com